Just imagine that any moment the universe splits into an infinite number of parallel universes and anything can happen. Therefore, no, 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 let me explain to you about my algorithm here. It would be much more interesting than your parallel universe. Oh, not this again. Since when do you have any idea what you've been talking about? Hey, guys, guys, look, there's someone here. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know there was anybody in here. Who is she? Hey, have you seen a red backpack anywhere? Hey, check it out. Red backpack right there. What's that, Jim? Huh? Oh, there it is. Thanks. You know, it's actually my boyfriend's. I was holding on to it for MG practice yesterday, and I guess I left it in there somehow. How responsible, huh? He's been giving me the third degree about it. Third degree? No idea. Black bow, it's all murder. Possibly, possibly. Does does your does your boyfriend hurt you? Uh, no. Then why would you say third degree? I guess she was blind, despised liar. But she smells so nice. Yes, she smells like a flower of the seventh leaf. The orange ones. That, that I like, but but not hurt people. That's really cool. I know. Hey, just last time you looked, there's that or a guy with eyes. No way, no way. They like the same thing. Okay, I get that. Stop it! Quiet! Oh no, she's mad. Say you're sorry. I, 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 I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to make you angry. I'm not angry. I, I make people angry a lot. Sometimes my, my mother says, oh, Austin, if you don't cut it out right now, I saw Patty off to leave it. And at first, I didn't know what cut it out meant because usually I can't have scissors or knives except for my dad and I don't look for It's okay. I'm not mad at all. Really. So just forget about it, okay? I think you talk too much. No, no, no. I think you better explain. But, but she said it means stop doing that. Usually, like when I'm yelling. She said people don't like it when I'm yelling, but but it's because it's because they touch me or or, or, or something. So, so 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 it's not my fault. But, but they make noise and, and and they laugh at me. Austin, come on! I would never laugh at you. I think it's awful that people do. You want me to go? Yes, I wish you'd go away so we could talk more. We never did finish our earlier conversations about farts. But her eyes. That's so beautiful. But no, no. Stay. Stay. Okay. So, you know, people do not have time a lot? You know, like, bother you? I, I, Just I, I tell the truth. Uh, I mean, yes. Well, what do they do? Do they laugh at you? Why are we talking about this again? Well, well, yeah. It's terrible. At, at first, I, I didn't mind when they laughed. I, I thought that laughing was good. I, I, I didn't know it was bad uh, until the time where, where Dave and, and Sam and I were playing a game where, where they kept throwing my rabbit keychain down the toilet and, and seeing how fast I, I could get it out and we, 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 we were all laughing but, but my dad came and, and he started yelling at them and, 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 and he said to me they're, they're only laughing at you in, in a mean way and, 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 and that's because, that's because you're, you're different but, but I, I don't want to be different. So, 
I don't laugh anymore. People can be so terrible. They are indeed. Wait, it, she's not though. Why is she be so nice? Because she likes you. Duh, keep it in. Do you have any friends here? Sometimes I think of my books as friends. Oh, books! Look, everybody, quarks! Little particles with funny names. Up, down, chow, shake, stop, bottom. 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 Oh, wait a second. Up, down, chow, shake, stop, bottom. You were talking about quarks, weren't you? Yeah. Oh, see, different types of quarks. <laughs> you know, I took physics last year, and we talked a little about quarks, but not much. So I checked out some other books because I have concepts in the board. I I taught myself too. There's there's a book I have. It it, it was the first thing I I ever read in physics when 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 I was seven and three quarters years old. You can have it if you want. No, oh, no, it's fine. Thanks. Well, well, what do you like to read? Oh. And welcome aboard, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain speaking. Can you stop it? You're distracting me. Austin, focus. She's talking about Stephen Hawking. Come on, you know this. Oh, oh, uh, I, 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 I like Stephen Hawking too. But when, when I hear of Schrodinger's cat, I reach for my pistol. <laughs> well, well, it was a joke that he made, but I don't really understand it because I never understand jokes. But I do know about Schrodinger's cat. So I like to say the joke because because it reminds me. Right. When the cat is alive and at the same time, it's, it's a mind game. It's either criticize the strangest or superposition or the combination of all the possible positions of a stop topic particle. Specifically, it's a criticism of how many get information with the device that. It's so literal about everything. What? What? I I can't help it. I know. It's okay. You're obviously really smart. You're just hard to follow sometimes. Follow. Follow. But I, I'm not going anywhere. I, I'm, I'm sitting here, and, and you're sitting there. What, what, what is it? You know, I've seen you around at lunch before. Hey, maybe we could sit together sometime. What? Oh, they said to get at lunch. He might be sitting by a different table. Anyway, she sat with him. She might have something purple, like cabbages, or beef, or a boot. My cat. Ah. The E I J one for you. No, 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 no. no, no, no. no planes. Guys, come on. New thought. New. Um, What's the matter? You look like a deer in headlights. Uh, a deer? Oh, no! Not the deer as you see in safaris. I didn't mean it literally, okay? It's just an expression. Hey guys, look! She's moving her face like she's happy again. What does it mean? Perhaps she would like to be friends. That would be great. Look at how her eyes sparkle. Wow. Austin, <laughs> what are you thinking about? Stars. Really? What? Why did you say... Really? Oh, exactly. Just, well, I never told anyone this because it's a little silly, but I'm kind of obsessed with stars. Every night, I'll take a blanket outside and just watch them hanging there in the sky. <laughs> Some nights, I need another for hours. Just, you know, looking up. And sometimes, my mom and dad, they argue a lot and I guess it's a lot more peaceful outside. You know, in the dark, with all the stars. I I have a telescope that, that I use every night uh, after I play mantra with my dad and, and before I feed Newton. That, that's at 8.15. So we're looking at the stars at the same time. Well, well, well not necessarily. Sometimes I, I do it earlier or, or later. Like when I'm studying a particular astral event, I, I like to immerse myself in its conventions. So, so when, when I'm stargazing, I use local mean time instead of Eastern Standard Time because local mean time historically governs the, the planetspheres and, and by that standard, every 13 square miles is, is a different time zone. So, so, so for, for you and me, time, time would probably be different by, by, by at least one minute and, and, not, and not to mention that time moves slower near, near the Earth's surface. So, so if, if, you, if, you, if you were in your yard, and I, I, I was on my balcony, that, that would make a difference too. You know what I say? What? I say, we're looking at the stars together. Oh, 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 oh. well, well uh, I've been locating stars within 100 light years of Earth and breaking down their light emissions into the visible spectrum and, and finding what wavelengths are missing. That's so cool. But are you always so scientific about it? Don't you ever just, you know, look up and wonder? Well, 
uh, uh, some nights when, when I'm looking for gamma ray activity in, in such a supernova, I, I like to think about the questions that we could answer for us if, if we understood them better. Like what? Like, does gravity have a repetitive component? Or where is the universe missing mass? Nothing. I think about those things too. They're just so mad and how small and limited the human mind is. And, and no shape to see in them because they are completely alien. Yet somehow they seem totally intuitive. Yes, exactly. Austin, you see the beauty too. But what I like to think about is, is how quiet and, and still it must be out there. And, and how in the space of all of that, that there are millions and millions wow. of stars and... The whole thing seems like a paradox. It's so beautiful, isn't it? And maybe that's why it creeps some people out. And all that stuff you were talking about. You know, supernovas and stardust and stuff. And knowing that you, just lying in your dicky backyard, are another part of the same whole universe. It's pretty unbelievable. It's also kind of strange, yet comforting because because it means anything is possible. Anything is possible. Yes, everything is possible. But but most people are are afraid of infinity. They, they, they think space is empty and and distant they, they, because because it doesn't make sense to them. They, they don't see space as a possibility. Space is an empty void, and, and 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 that's what I don't understand. Because for me, it's it's different. Space, space is where I would feel comfortable. It's here. It's here that is a void. For me, it's different because space is where I would feel comfortable. It is here that it's a point. Don't. Austin, it doesn't have to be like that anymore. Okay? We'll make them see just how beautiful space really is. We'll take back the world and show them what they're missing. And then it won't be a point anymore. Alright, I promise. I won't let it be. Okay? She's absolutely, without doubt, the best that ever happened in the history of the universe. She's like, co op. Yes, and I'm going to the numbers and extract those. Because the X doesn't satisfy the predicate in finding it. Are you there? I go wrong.